Let's just look at kidneys in a little more detail for a second. You good right there. Uh, I might have your big breath for me. So kidney, bright white capsule, darker renal cortex, bright white renal pelvis. Sometimes renal pyramids are visible. Again, just noting the spine posteriorly stops at the diaphragm. You can relax. Okay. On this side, we see the right kidney. Uh, a little bit of big, big breath for me. And again, bright white capsule, darker cortex, renal pelvis. It's almost the same echo texture as the liver. So we'll go ahead and take a look at the bladder. So bladder is always a little lower than you think it's going to be. So we fan, we get right above the pubic symphysis, fan towards the feet. Here's the bladder. It's not a circle. It's kind of a trigonal shape. And as we fan towards the patient's head in the female, we see the uterus. In this case, we see a small amount of free fluid, which is normal behind it, but that's where we look for free fluid in like a trauma setting. And in this case, we can see left ovary. And not sure I can see right ovary. It's probably sitting there. And just a sagittal view. We see bladder in front uterus, posterior, cul-de-sac with a small amount of normal physiologic free fluid. All right, just the difference of the bladder in the male versus the female. So again, we're looking for the bladder just above the pubic symphysis. Take note that the bladder is not a circle. And in the male, we can see there's prostate sitting back there. As we fan up, then we shouldn't see really much else.